This photo illustrates the front of the engine. You do not need to remove the cooling fan and shroud or the cooling system upper radiator hose, but we have done so for photographic purposes. Locate the accessory drive belt tensioner as indicated by the green arrow. With a 19mm socket, loosen but do not remove the drive belt tensioner mounting bolt. This photo illustrates the driver's side of the engine. To the left of the power steering fluid reservoir, loosen by turning counterclockwise the drive belt tensioner adjustment screw several full turns. This allows the tensioner to move and loosen the belt. Now that the tensioner is loose, move the tensioner pulley in the direction of the blue arrow and the belt will be loose on the pulleys. Pull the belt off each pulley noting its position of installation. Route the belt as you found it originally on the car. Here is the way the belt should be routed. Tighten the drive belt tensioner adjusting screw until the tensioner pulley grips the belt. While tightening the drive belt adjusting screw, feel the deflection of the drive belt, green arrow. You should only feel a half of an inch of deflection on either side of the belt for it to be tight enough. Do not over tighten the belt as this can cause premature belt failure and wear out the bearings on your drive pulleys. Tighten the 19mm drive belt tension fastener to hold the adjustment in place. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.